It's time now for Eye on Education. Well, demand for STEM talent continues to surge in Indiana and beyond. Case in point, check out Rose Holman Institute of Technology's annual fall career fair this week in Terre Haute. A record, get this, 283 companies showed up in search of interns or co-op students in science, engineering, and technology disciplines. 25% of those companies visiting campus for the very first time. Now, the push is on to keep more of that talent, that STEM talent, in Indiana. It's booming, and we have a lot of emerging technology that's happening in the marketplace. We're also filling the supply chain demands that uh, have come about because of COVID-19. And then we also have a lot of uh, technologies being onshored again here in the U.S. So those are exciting opportunities for our students. Salaries for STEM workers are on the rise, too. Rose Holman says the average starting salary for its new graduates, more than $81,000. The Ball State University Board of Trustees has approved the transfer of more than 12 acres of land to the Muncie Redevelopment Commission. The university says the property will help the city develop up to 40 new homes just northwest of campus, generating additional tax revenue for the city and Muncie Community Schools.